Hey, what's going on dudes? It's Mitch, or Beijing Canadian here, with a solo awesome parkour course, because I know a lot of you out there enjoy watching me rage and suffer and feel like a complete jag while trying to do some parkour. So here we are on a brand new 1.8 parkour course, which is actually going to be really awesome because it's totally random. That's right, this is going to be an auto-generated parkour course that's different every single time you play. So I'm going to go ahead and do, give me some night vision, perfecto mundo, and... Well, I guess maybe we should read the how to play, but I'm going to press this first anyways because I think it's going to be cool. Generating parkour! The parkour is now generating! <laughs> Look at that go. That is awesome. I'm going to go ahead and read the how to play book now just so I know what's going on. And the map was made by these beautiful people on screen and tested by these other, well, daring souls. So let's go ahead and read the how to play and let's see what we got here. How to play. Very simple. Page one and two. The high ground. How to play. Press the generate parkour button, the map will generate parkour. Complete the generated parkour, repeat. Press the give night vision button for night vision. Yes, it's really just that simple. Perfect, thank you for giving me a book that was really self-explanatory. Uh, jumps edition, what does this say? Page one of one. Make sure to check out the high ground jumps edition. It should be included with your download of the high ground. The jumps edition contains new sections, new patterns, and tons more jumping. All right, so I guess I'll have to go ahead and try that one out. Um, perhaps another time. We'll see how this one goes. So here we go on the high ground parkour. And we can go this way. This is pretty cool. Yes, it's very nice. Um, it hasn't been any parkour yet. It's like a big staircase. Okay, that wasn't too difficult. This is my kind of parkour, everyone. Something that's just easy peasy, lemon squeezy. I'm loving this. I'm loving this so far. Baby. Oh, baby. This is, this was made for me. This was designed specifically for the Benja Kanata. It doesn't get much more basic than this one. Actually though, it is really cool. The patterns are awesome. It's cool to see the different blocks come in here, all the half slabs. And most importantly, it's just cool that it's random. So every single time you're going to get a different course, even though it's not super, super challenging, it's, uh, it's more about the architectural design. And it keeps going up for a really long time. Look how high this goes. So if you slip and fall at any point, it's wreck or rooney. So you really do have to flawless this. Otherwise, it's rip. You're done. So I'm hoping I don't trip and fall. Because if I do, I'm a dead man. <laughs> and I don't want to be a dead man. I was just bragging about how convenient this is that it's playable and not too difficult for me. But it looks like it's getting harder the higher we go. So let's see as we ascend how much trickier it gets. And we've got some more basic wood slabs. Ooh, I could have bumped my head on those. So we, we, we're adding a little bit of bonus dynamics to the game here. Gotta watch for my noggin so I don't smack it on a slab above my head. All right, we're just doing loop-de-loops. Woo, crossing over. That was risky, that was a risque move. All right, jump, jump, jump. I'm starting to get a little dizzy. <laughs> How a real bad feeling that I'm gonna mess up soon. But if I follow this entire generation, I'll be pretty pleased with myself. I gotta be getting close. Whoa. I think I'm getting close, unless it keeps loading in chunks up there that I can't see. Oh, that time there was nothing blocking me from falling on the side of that. Usually it's up against the wall. All right, we're getting a little trickier. I like this. I like this. All right, this, the brick slabs don't let me down. Let's keep inching forward here. Take a quick gander, see what we got. Ooh, diamonds and gold at the top. That must be the end of the course, maybe. Can I make it, baby? Baby girl, can I make it flawlessly? I really don't want to mess this up now. I'm somehow going to trip and fall on the easiest thing ever. I can already feel it. Somehow I'm gonna mess up two blocks from the end. Okay, I don't think I can mess up. I've done it! Yes! Made it to the tippity tippity top. And wow, that was awesome. All right, so just take me back down. Cool. Generated level complete. All right, let's press this again. See what we get. Is it regenerated? Starting generation, please wait. Setting up command blocks for future generation. Generation complete, have fun. Did it change? I'm gonna press it again. Did anything, I'm just trying to pay attention here, see if anything changes near me. Setting up command blocks for future generation. Please, please show me. Oi, I don't think it changed. That's really, really weird. That's okay. Um, what I'm gonna do actually is just gonna reload the map real quick and try out the other version that he mentioned here, the jumps edition. I'm gonna reload the map with that one. So if you're enjoying it up until this point, be sure to show some love. Slap it at like button. Let's go for 10,000 like a Rudy's. That would be great. 
And of course, if you're new to my channel, I hope you'll consider subscribing for more fun banterous commentary and tons of Minecraft videos every single day of the week. And other than that, I will be right back. Alrighty, so we are back. This is the Jump Edition. So we're going to go ahead and give ourselves night vision, generate the parkour, and watch as this baby constructs itself. That is magnificent. Starting generation, please wait. I got my achievement for taking inventory. That's awesome. And is she done yet? Are you done up there? Generation complete. Have fun. And I assume this is going to be the same book. Yep, it really, really is. So let's throw that out and let's get to it. This one's probably going to be a bit trickier. Because he says there's a lot more generations. And yeah, there's a lot more jumps already on this guy. So this is the challenge of the day. This is the one that I was after. So let's see if I can flawless this bad boy. I'm trying to do this quickly. I don't want to stop too often either. I want to keep a good pace. Oh boy. Oh boy. We slipped up. We slipped up. So we're not going to flawless it. Can we even beat it though? That's the question. Because some of these jumps are tricky. They're not as simple as they once were. No, they are not. All right, onto some wooden slabs. But we can still move at a good pace, which I like. I hate the parkour maps that they're too hard, so you constantly have to repeat the same jumps and go back and forth. It's just so boring and rage-inducing. Like, let me run quickly and just make the course longer. Make it more fun, honestly. That's why I love speed parkour, the ones where you just sprint race it. Because even if I played against somebody like Preston, who's really good at parkour, I can still beat him. Because it's about how crazy you can do the jumps in a row consistently. Oh, that was a tumble. That was a good tumble. Whereas some parkour where there's like eight four block jumps in a row, I just can't stand those because I suck at four block jumps. And some of these, oh my god, I did the same thing twice in a row. Are you serious? All right, we're not going to do three. Three is not the charm. It is not. So we're going to mix it up and come from this angle. Oi, the rude sandstorm. All right, come on, this time for sure. Oh, come on. Can I really not make this jump? It's not that tough. There we go. There we go. Let's keep moving. Let's keep moving and grooving. We can get to the top of this one. I can't. Can I even see the golden diamond up there yet? No, I'm way down. I got to get quite a bit higher. But this is cooler. The jumps edition is legit. Oh, thank goodness I made that. I was kind of worried about that jump. Gonna was, I had a feeling it was going to be a real pain in the booty, but it wasn't. I'm doing great. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's no bueno. All right, good. I didn't fall too far. That could have been way worse. All right. Let's clear this. Let's clear this zone, shall we? There we go. Was this a big jump? Yes. Yes. Keep going. Don't stop. Oh, I don't like these. Oh, yeah. There it is. There she blows. And we are on to the next wood slab zone. Heck, yeah. We're doing really, really well right now. I don't want to mess this up. Oh, look at the X Factor coming in hot. All right. Keep going. Keep going. I can almost smell them. I can almost smell the diamonds. Oh, that was close. I almost took a huge tumble there. You know when you second guess yourself in midair and you pull back a bit? Never fun. Oh, that was a close one. A little more, a little more, my good sir. Can we see the gold up there? Oh, yeah, I can't see it yet, but maybe it's not. Maybe it's not always golden diamonds. Maybe it changes. It just might. Because so I see some green clay. Oh, these one blocks are supposed to be easy, you'd think. But there's a lot of room for error. There we go. Okay. No! Oh, God! Oh, autumn's spicy. That was a big fall. Let's not do that again, please. Let's really not do that again. That'd be great. That would be phenomenal. Oh, jeez. Okay. Okay. All right, we're good. We passed where we fell from. We're so close to the tip top. I can smell it, I can see it, I can taste it. No, I don't wanna mess this up though. I'm getting real close. Please, just a little more. Just a little more flawless jumping. Yes. Come on. We have touchdown. We made it. All right. So I'm going to give myself a little bonus challenge here. Instead of pressing the button to get down to the bottom, I'm going to see if I can dodge everything. I'm going to set spawn point. I'm going to turn this into the dropper. Here we go. All right. Let's find a clear path. Juke, 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 juke. Oh, that hurt. 
All right, juke, juke. Oh, the clouds. The clouds. Gotta turn clouds off. That's awful. Video settings. Um, where is it? Clouds. Clouds off. There we go. Back to game. And Geronimo. Dodge, 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 dodge. Ooh. No bueno. Juke Serino. Juke Serino. This is impossible. I don't think I can do this. I'm gonna give it another couple of tries though, just for fun. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That was so close. I almost did this as a dropper mat. That's legit. See if we can pull it off. There's the gap. Oh, that thigh gap though. Almost had it. Almost had it. Pull back, go forward, pull back. Oh, last try. This is the final countdown. Doo -doo -doo -doo. That was a fail. Whatever, we'll go from here. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Oh, I didn't like that one. This is the real one. I don't know, at least pass that cobble slab. This is the one. Oh, we did it. Touchdown made it all the way from the tippity top to the very, very bottom of this high lands parkour, high grounds parkour, the jump edition, whatever you want to call it. Who cares? This was an awesome auto-generated 1.8 super unique map. And uh, big props to the map makers. Really well done. Great job here. And once again, if you enjoyed the video, be sure to slap that like button. Show some love. 10,000 likes would be awesome, especially for that big dropper fall at the end of this. That was insane. So glad I made that on the last try. That just made this video 10 times better. And other than that, I will see you dudes all later. Love you long time. Have a great day or night. And I'll see you later. Bye-bye.